Okay guys, Shaber 1000 here. Today, we're going to make this junk look like this. Stay tuned, we'll show you how to do that. Alright guys, today we're going to be installing this Z-Line um, range hood up here on this. So, this what, so, but the first thing I got to do is, you know, I've got to put this up here. Of course, make sure your, your electric shut off, which I will do that here in a minute. But in order to put this up, to hang that, our range hood, I'm going to have to cut this out some more. It needs to be repaired anyway. And I need to find right there is a stud. So... I'm good there and I know there's studs over here so I'm probably just going to have to put one right across here. But first I need to get this cut out and I'm going to do that and once I get that cut out, it's just drywall guys, it's nothing, I mean you know, nothing fancy going on here. Um, I'm going to move this stove, I'm going to get on a ladder, get that cut out and I'll be right back with you guys. What are you doing monkey? Waiting patiently. Waiting patiently. You've waited three years, you can wait three more days. No. Okay. All right, so that's what we're going to do, guys. She's going to help me out and do a little filming maybe, but I'm not going to bore you with cutting that out. So I'm going to get my wood cut. I'm going to get this cut out, get my measurements, get my wood cut, get this cleaned up and ready to go. And uh, I'll be back with you guys. So hang tight. All right, guys, we're back. This is what I've done so far. I cut this out I, I had to put a plate in here two before I'm sorry a, a two before not a plate for this plate to screw on now the other ones there was already one there so I put one one here so I can get screwed into and I put my let's see can you see it I put my box up in there that way all I got to do is, is plug it in and we're gonna lift this up here now this over here is gonna need finished as well but I'm going to do that later because we're going to put something here some kind of lighting over here but we're not sure what we're going to do yet and I'm sure that I may have some finishing to do then so that's when I'm going to going to do this here now we have this set up now you can hardwire or you can plug it in now that's why I put the plug up there so I didn't have to hardwire this just screws on it's self-explanatory so I didn't show it there's a little rubber seal that goes on there but just those six screws that go around there and then this goes up in there like that and then this will go up inside that hole there. Now this is pretty heavy, it's like 40 pounds. So I'm gonna get Monkey to help me hold it and then I gotta start, get these little tiny screws in there and get so you can watch a little bit of this, okay? All right. Well, that way, if something happens, we will have it on camera. Uh, what are you laughing at? Well, that was not very positive. No, it is positive. I said if it does, which it will not, I'm sure. All right. Let me make sure I got my screwdriver. Screwdriver. All right, are you ready? I'm going to have to have you on this side. I'm actually scared of trying to turn. Well, you can't be scared, honey. All right. Not about a thing. Yep. All right, you ready? Mm -hmm. Okay, and just back in there. I have the back in here? Yeah, it would be best. Uh -huh. I lost my shoe. Oh. Yeah. That's got to go in that hole. I know, but I'm in the way. 
but this has got to go in that hole. It's got to go straight up, honey. You can't go at an angle like that. All right, now, push it on up in there. Hang on, hang on, one second. All right. Now, are you lined up on your things? No. Huh? No, I'm not even in. There's one with the bat, no. Uh -uh. That corner's not going in. It, it will. Okay. It will. Let me put mine in. It's, it's got to go somewhat straight. You got yours in? Yeah. Now mine are in. Okay. Hang on a second. Okay. Let's we'll set this down for a second. All right. Okay, you got to kind of watch. Hold on to it, though, don't. It's okay, relax. There. Thought I left them loose enough. I guess I didn't. See, these are adjustable, see? Uh -huh. So now, it should go up in there. And then you go back and tighten them and put little tiny nuts on them. Is that better? I got one, but I can't do it. I got it. I got it. It's got to go up. Uh uh, it's stuck. All right. I take see it, where it's stuck. Take it, down, take it down, man. Okay. Let's set it back now. Let's put it back over here. That's what I just said. You sound like a guy I work with. I say something, then he says it like he had the idea. That piece? Yeah. In here? It's hanging. Well, these up. need to be moved down, huh? It, hanging, it was hanging right here. Yeah. It, it will go, though. You know what I mean? Yeah. It will go. But it got stuck because it went like this. When you went to put it up, it went like this a little bit. So the plastic piece was rubbing and hitting that one piece. This piece? Yeah, yeah. Right there? Yeah. So that's why I said you had to kind of... Kind of... So it can go up in there. Let me loosen these up a little bit more and then I'll re-tighten them. See, so they can move some. Huh? What? That's said if I push the fridge. Well, that's another thing. He was kind of sideways. It might help too because I'll give us more room. Honey, the wheels don't roll that way. They only roll forward and backwards, not sideways. That's all I need is a little bit. I mean. All right. All right. Let's try this start. again, huh? Honey, I lift 200 pound axles almost every day. You only got one shot at them. All right. Let's do this again. Ready? One, two, three. One, two, three. <laughs> Just pick it up. I don't like air. One, two, three. Let's he do does that. that. One, face. two, three. I'm like, I'm standing there. I'm like, you know, let's just do it. He's like, okay, I'm going to count. Dude, just grab it and growl, you know. <laughs> Yeah, I see it. Okay, I'm just going to have to trim that. All right, let's take it out. It's no problem. Uh -uh. I see they didn't cut that off straight. No, they were jerks. All right. I'll just bring the cut off wheel in here and I'll trim that out, no problem. 
All right, guys. I have to trim that corner back there. So I'm going to do that, and then I'll turn you guys back on. So hang tight. All right, guys, we're back. Sorry we had to cut you off. We was having problems, and I'll tell you why. Because these hood ranges, or range hoods, are supposed to be mounted up from the ceiling is where they're getting their measurements from. Now, as you can see, we have a drop here because this used to be cabinets, and then it had a fan here, but it was a cabinet mount. It was up inside the cabinets. Well, this, you know, they want you to have the top part of this 30 inches minimum from the top of your range for, of course, safety reasons and, and whatnot. So what I had to do was I had to cut these down and re-drill holes and slot them so that they would fit and so I could get my, my um, height here. Well doing that that meant I had to fabricate the outer pieces the it's called the chimney it's like the, it's the cover that goes uh, goes around that right there and this is just one half of it so I had to fabricate that and cut it down so that way it'll fit up in here because like I said it's supposed to go way up there and come down since we couldn't do that I had to do some fabrication that's why we stopped you now in your case, you'll do just what we was doing. Only yours will probably line up pretty good. And also, they gave us the wrong base plate, too. This should be as wide as this, and it's not. It's a little bit. And I don't know if you can see in there, but this is offset. The hose, and they don't have the offset base plate to where the hose will go straight up. But that's okay. I mean, you know, it, it curves. So we're good there, but I, I had to had to do some fabrication on this one which you shouldn't have to do on yours if you're going straight up to the ceiling if you do have to do something like this get someone to help you because you will have to fabricate that and they will not tell you that so here's you know the uh, here's the fan two three and four here's the lights right there are four lights and we also have the controls over here as well on both sides so that is pretty cool I didn't know it had that so that's pretty neat so I'm gonna get off here I'm gonna get this put up um, all I'm doing it's just like you know two sides I'll put that one on that side and then the other side on here and I'll screw it in up here at the top and then um, I'll give you a complete final oh I gotta put our our screen in here and then I'll I'll show you the final product. So there you go. Monkey's pretty happy. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Well, ecstatically happy. You're ecstatically happy. Three years. Three years? Yeah. yeah. She's very happy. I really made happy. Yeah. It, it is nice. And I'll show you if you can see this. What I'm going to do here. This is on two. The speed. See, it's on two. I just lit a cigarette. Let's see if you can see this. Sucks it right up out. So, there you go. Um, I'll be back with you and we'll show you the final product and our final thoughts. <laughs> so, stick around guys. I'll be right back in just a second. There it is, guys. All done. Like I said, I got some finished work to do up here, but we're gonna put some kind of lighting system here, which I know I'm gonna have to do some finished work, so I'm just gonna do that all at once. So, but there it is. All done, ready to rock. Now all we gotta do is get 
our little bar. That's why we had to get a slider stove. Get our bar in here. Goes around here. Yep. And it'll be fine, huh? Yeah. You like it? Oh yeah. 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 I love it. Yeah, it's quiet. It's only on two, but it's still quiet. So that's pretty cool. Controls on both sides. Yeah. Yeah. Which we didn't know. No, I didn't realize that it had that. Never even said when I went online and read it. You never say anything about it. Right. Yeah. So, well, honey, there's all kinds of paw prints here. Paw prints. Yeah. It's got fingerprints there. Anyway, so there's what we got. There's what we got. And it worked out pretty good. A lot of fabrication to make this one work with that one foot drop there. So, but that's okay. We did it. Made it work, huh? Yeah, we did. Yeah. We did. All right, well, we're going to have a cookout, huh? Yes. Getting late, so. We'll yeah. kick something out on the grill. That'll be good. Have a couple of drinks. Sound good? Yep. All right. There you go, Monk. Uh, thank you very much. You're welcome. Bye. Bye. Monkey's out. Shea Bear, I'm gone. Remember, the myth, man, the legend. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Check out Monkey 1000. Thanks, guys. See you soon.